your news on the go. Before, here's your news on the go this morning. The Manlius police chief suddenly resigned this week, but the community may never know why because of the separation agreement, and it also has many restrictions with no explanations. Michael Crowell will be paid $135,000 and promises to never file a lawsuit against the town. The town of Manlius will also not share its concerns about the chief's conduct. Well, if you're looking to maintain, remodel, or improve your home, you are in luck this weekend. The CNY Home and Garden Show makes a return at the fairgrounds this weekend. Hundreds of exhibits will be on display to spruce up your home from the inside all the way to the backyard. The show continues today from 10 until 8 and tomorrow 10 until 5. Tickets are $10. Anyone 16 and under are free. Parking is also free. And maybe while you're at the fairgrounds, stop by the Jurassic Quest to get your fix of the Triassic period. Today and tomorrow, you can check out one of the biggest dinosaur experiences in all of the country. Life-size dinosaurs will be on display, along with rides, interactive activities, and even some dinosaur shows. Hours and ticket prices do vary for this show. 7.55, Tom is back for a final check of our weekend wintry, windy, and cold forecast. <laughs> this sums it up, Adrian. Looking at those wind speeds, they will be increasing through the afternoon, so it will feel significantly colder out there. The 40s we just saw over the last couple of days, just a thing of the past. High temperatures today will only be into the mid to upper 30s, and yet the wind in on top of that, it'll feel like the 20s outside. Live Doppler 9, starting to see a few light flurries come through central New York here, but overall for today, scattered snow showers will come through by the afternoon. There's that high of 38 degrees, feeling like the 20s outside, much cooler. The big news will be the lake effect snow to our north. Here's a snow for, snowfall projected map here. 6 to 12 inches of snow for the highest elevations across the Tug Hill region. Pretty sharp, cut, sharp cutoff as you head towards Syracuse and point south of Syracuse, a trace if anything. So you can see the high totals that we are projecting later today into tonight and through early tomorrow morning. Tomorrow's high temperatures, significantly colder, 32 degrees, still rather breezy out there. The winds from the west at 20 miles per hour. So once we get past the weekend, check out Monday, first day of spring, sunny skies, 47 degrees, and we stay rather mild too. Tuesday, Wednesday, near 50 degrees. Eventually some rain showers move in by the end of the work week. So spring looks to start off quite nice once we get past the wintry weekend here. Yeah, we just have to get through this weekend. We Hold on to winter a little bit, get to Monday, and then we're smooth sailing, Bundle hopefully. <laughs> Thanks, Tom. And thank you for joining us. We hope you have a fantastic Saturday.